Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to part three of my Christmas Eve special. That's right. I don't normally upload on Saturdays, but since it's Christmas Eve, I decided that uh, you guys deserve a little special treat. So if you haven't seen the last two videos, please uh, check out the playlist. But now we're going to be playing No Strings Attached, a game by uh, Zed Technician. And he's look at that little smiley face. You know this is going to be a good game. He's so happy about it. Uh, but we're going to go ahead and let's go. Press X to skip. Why would I skip? Hi, lady. Damn. You got lots to love. Thud, thud. Damn, girl. Maggie! Yo! <laughs> nice! She got 20, 20, 20 vision, bro. All right, who's making all that dang racket, eh? Keep it up and I'll put you out on the street. Don't go thinking I won't now. Making all that noise when I'm trying to nap. Who in the right mind? Wait. I ain't no guests here tonight. Jesus. She got some real dope on honkeros. I'm going to bed. You can stay. You can leave. Don't matter too much to me. But wake me up again, and we're going to have problems. Got it? Present? Open me. What kind of darn fool do you take me for? I ain't opening that. <laughs> oh, I love this game. Mm -hmm. Shoot. All right. Find the clue, then open your gift. Eight missing legs. It's a spider. What we got? We got, hello, what you got for me? Wrong one. Huh? Uh-oh. Oh. As the intruder closed the distance between himself and Maggie, a single deafening thud reverberated through the night. Then all fell silent once more. Not long after, the intruder was dropped off at the local hospital by Maggie! Maggie! She then casually went about her business that night. The man had knocked, been knocked into a state of stone-cold unconsciousness after being bludgeoned by her cane. Despite her best efforts, the doctor was unable to wake him even after many, many attempts. The man didn't wake in long after Christmas. Maggie! Yeah! Maggie! That's amazing. All right. Unheated food. Goes in the microwave, right? Nice. Whoop. There's no microwave in this one. But hurry, for at midnight I will come find you. It's dark outside. Okay, so go outside. It's dark outside. What could it mean? Is there one with a window? There we go. <clears throat> I remain unmade. Ah, we're looking for a bed that's unmade. There you are. This one. The best thing since sliced bread. That one. So right here. Vitamin C. Oranges. Yeah. Oranges. Losing track of time. Uh, the one that doesn't have an alarm clock in it? Oh! It's the one that's reset. Burn it a both candle. Lost signal. Oh, it's spooky time. A second box. A second box. Shit box? Nope. Vitamin C. Orange. Seven years bad luck. Yeah, broken mirror. Hi. Santa. A second box. Okay. Yeah. Open the closet. Open the closet. What closet? Oh. Oh, that's spooky. Hang on a minute. <laughs> 
open the closet. This actually got kind of spooky. Good, good job. This one. <clears throat> hey, buddy. Damn, you thick. I've got you now. I. <laughs> hey, wait a minute. You're not Jimmy. What? You're not Jimmy. He's supposed to be here. You're not him. He lives right at 9189 Zara Lane. But this is 6861 Zara Lane. Crap. I'm at the wrong house. Boy, you better start explaining what in the heck's going on here before I decide to knock you upside the head. <laughs> He's jacked. So, yeah, I live down at Moonwater Commune with my brothers and sisters. Yesterday, this guy shows up and he's like, I want to cut this tree down and take it home to use for decoration. And we tell him, no, that's one of our sacred trees. Don't take that one. But then he starts chopping it down anyway. And I'm like, uh, I'm there, you know? 100% ready to start throwing punches right then and there. But then the Grand Elder shows up and goes, no, Philip, you mustn't do that. So, I waited until everyone left and then started tracking the guy down. Turns out his name was Jimmy. My plan was just to scare him a little bit, you know? I wasn't going to hurt him or anything. But then I went to the wrong address. So, yeah, sorry about that. Anyway, I gotta go find Jimmy now. Are you crazy or something? You can't go do that! Huh? You can't just go barging into folks' homes, boy! You can get hurt, or worse! But what about Jimmy? Forget about him! I know you're too young and headstrong and stupid and realize it now, but you can't just take matters into your own hands like that. There's a right way to go about things, and there's a wrong way, too. I shouldn't have to tell you that breaking and entering is definitely ain't the right way. But enough of that. I've had enough dealing with you and your nonsense for tonight. So get lost and let me sleep in peace. And don't you let me catch you doing something stupid like this again, you hear? Okay, thanks, miss. <laughs> well, it would have worked, but it would have worked, Phil. It definitely would have worked. You got me. You got me a little bit, Phil. <laughs> and that was no strings attached. What a fun game. What a really fun game that was. All right, that was fun. But, uh, yeah, so this will conclude my Christmas special. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure that if you haven't watched the other ones yet, go ahead and watch the rest of the playlist, which should be appearing right about uh, there in the top left. Uh, but yeah, if you like what you see and you want to see more, go ahead and subscribe and bell and blah, 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 blah. Merry Christmas.